Greetings to everyone out there and welcome back to Around the Clock. Alright everybody, a brand new glitch has been discovered within Echoes of Wisdom that allows you to play as Link with all of his abilities included his shield, sword, arrow, and bombs instead of Princess Zelda in this game. Now I ran across this info in a brand new article found on NintendoWire.com that gives you all the details step by step on how to play as Link and no, I'm not going to show you the steps in this video for obvious reasons but if you want to check this out for yourself check out my source link down in the description box below that will send you to this article or just google glitch how to play as Link in Echoes of Wisdom. Now I do want to point something out because after you complete all the steps in the article it does say this. You'll now have access to Link's weapons including the sword, shield, arrows, and bombs. Be warned that your progress will be effectively reset meaning your map and dungeon progress will be wiped. You won't be able to see certain things like rifts but you should be able to continue on with the game. You also won't be able to use any of the tri rod abilities. So they all have it. Hey, if you do this, you're doing this at your own risk. I'm not telling you to do this. This is all up to you. And I just wanted to point this out because I saw this. There's a bunch of different websites that are putting this out. So hey, man, if you're interested and you want to take that risk, go ahead and do so. But hey, I have to be honest. I don't understand why you want to play this game as Link anyway because the purpose is to play as Princess Zelda, to utilize all the different echoes, you know, to solve puzzles as well as to defeat enemies. So, hey, it's all up to you. Plus, this game already gives you the ability to utilize Link's powers. So, hey, to each his own. Now, we all know that Nintendo is going to patch this glitch as soon as possible. So, if you want to take advantage of this, I would advise you to do it as soon as possible. But you'll be doing this at your own risk. Now, as far as my opinion on Echoes of Wisdom, I'm enjoying this game so far. I had roughly about a week to play this game and I'm enjoying every step of the way. I love the story. I love the whole lore behind certain things in this game as well. And I'm loving these Echo abilities and how you use them in the game. You use them to solve different puzzles as well as defeat certain enemies. So yeah, man, it's dope. And I'm loving the whole map too. Like there's all these different locations like they have in Breath of the Wild and Echoes of Wisdom. So this is like a brand new top down version of those games and yeah man so far in my opinion this game is definitely one of my games of the year i haven't beaten it yet so i can't say it's my game of the year but we'll see what happens at the end of the game so with that being said guys that's gonna do it for this video please make sure to like share and subscribe for all of you that are not already subscribed to this channel and as always remember to keep it locked here at around the clock where here we focus on nintendo news content around the clock I'll catch you guys in the next video.